Having more than 200,000 subscribers, YouTube Bros is one of the most popular statistic channel out there, averaging about 30,000 views every video and getting about 10,000 subscribers every month. Matt, better known online as YouTube Bros, is an American YouTuber who does data visualization and live stream of big YouTubers reaching big milestones and subscriber races. YouTube Bros started his channel on 7th of November 2015 under the name of Pony and uploading his first video on the same day. His first video was all about him playing the game called Game of Bombs. The video is sitting around 790 views today with many people saying a legend was born. The next few months, he kept uploading a Game of Bombs video. Not a lot happened until on August 30, 2018 when PewDiePie uploaded a video declaring a subscriber was on T-Series as T-Series was about to surprise PewDiePie in the end of the year. Flare TV and many other people started making live stream and video about this war and Pony would soon create a channel that would inspire many people. On January 24, 2019, YouTube Battle channel was created and 3 months later, YouTube Battles would upload the first video on the channel titled PewDiePie vs T-Series Secret Plan U. It was a 48 second video showcasing T-Series and their fans unsubscribing to T-Series and subscribing to PewDiePie and then couple minutes later, they would unsubscribing to PewDiePie and resubscribing to T-Series resulting a U on the graph. The video is sitting around 35,000 views today. His first 4 videos were him making an update about the PewDiePie vs T-Series war. Those 4 videos have gotten around 525,000 overall views. The reason of why his first video was so success was because his videos were time lapses which is unique at the time because nobody has done it. On April 12, 2019, YouTube Battles would upload a 19 hour time lapse of Jacksepticeye surpassing Ninja. The video is sitting around 512,000 views but what's even more surprising is he got noticed by the big YouTuber in the platform, Mr. Beast. That's right, Mr. Beast commented on his Jacksepticeye vs Ninja video. He commented, I want a battle, which YouTube Battles would do next. YouTube Battles uploaded his final update about the PewDiePie vs T-Series war where T-Series offered to PewDiePie for the last time. YouTube Battles knew that if he kept making subscriber count time lapses, he could grow his channel. He kept jumping on the latest trends and the latest YouTube drama to try and catch up and make a time lapse about this. May 31st, 2019. T-Series would be the first channel to hit 100 million subscribers and YouTube Battles would make a 50 hour time lapse about the event. The video absolutely blows up and got his video to the YouTube algorithm. It is his first video to get 1 million views. After this, YouTube Battles continued to upload subscriber time lapses where there is a YouTuber passing another YouTuber or a YouTuber reaching a new milestone and all of those videos actually reached 100,000 views. This is also the time where he would upload more Mr. Beast statistic related time lapse videos, PewDiePie 100 million update videos and and he would also start a live stream and those live stream actually helped his channel grow big. On August of 24, 2019, PewDiePie would be the first YouTube individual to hit 100 million subscriber mark and YouTube Battles would upload a 9 hour video about the PewDiePie reaching 100 million subscribers. He also uploaded another related video about the moment PewDiePie reaches 100 million subscribers on his stream. Both of those videos actually got into the YouTube algorithm and they got him a lot of subscribers. But unfortunately, all good things must come to an end and YouTube would abbreviate the public subscriber count on September 17, 2019, and YouTube Battles would make his last subscriber time lapse video. YouTube Battles had to stick out by making other time lapses like view time lapses and Twitch and Twitter time lapses. While those videos perform okay, it is still sad that YouTube Battles isn't gonna upload subscriber time lapses anymore. Or is it? On April 8, 2020, Mr. Beast just dropped his gaming channel, Mr. Beast Gaming. And as soon as YouTube Battles found out about the channel, YouTube Battles has made his one of the most popular live streams on his channel. MrBeast even saw that livestream and YouTube Battles would make 3 subscriber time lapses about his MrBeast gaming livestream. Now of course, when good things happen, there's also a lot of bad things that also happens. And for whatever reason, when YouTube Battles would start a new livestream, YouTube would just decided to shadow ban YouTube Battles stream. It is still unexplainable on why that happened even to this day. YouTube Battles would need to upload something different or else his channel would die. Luckily, YouTube removed YouTube Battles shadow ban a couple months later and on July of 2020, YouTube Butters would upload his top 10 fastest growing channel on June of 2020. The video actually did quite well. Even better on August 21, 2020 when BTS uploaded their music video called Dynamite. YouTube Butters immediately made a live stream about this. The music video got over 108.2 million views in 24 hours and the live stream went viral and YouTube Butters was able to gain 25,000 subscribers in 15 days. Like we mentioned in my iceberg video, the K-pop stands would search and visit a lot of live view count live streams just to see BTS 
would be able to get the record on having the most viewed video in 24 hours and YouTube Otis was blessed with the YouTube algorithm. He kept doing monthly reports videos and also making new live stream which also helped his channel. Over the next few months, another large event that has happened. The United States are having an election and YouTube Otis decided to make a live stream about the US election voting. That got him an additional of 7,000 subscribers. 2020 was coming to an end. A lot of crazy things happened. YouTube Otis would make his last live stream of the year, which literally broke his channel. He made a live stream about New Year's Countdown, which peaked at 110,548 viewers and especially a lot of subscribers. January 15, 2021, the day that may sound familiar to you, JaxXL Live, a popular YouTuber, uploaded a video titled, Which of my subscribers has the most subscribers? It was a video about him reacting to his subscribers and finding out who is his number one most subscribed subscribers. In the middle of the video, Jack actually shouted out YouTube Battles since it was about to reach 100,000 subscribers milestone. To be fair, I would like to get YouTube Battles to 100k because I do know them. If you like my kind of YouTube analytics stuff, you will like their videos. They do like sub count battles, so you can see right now they're live with Dream and Mr. Beast. YouTube Battles would soon make a live stream about him hitting 100,000 subscribers. Couple hours later, Mr. Beast shouted out YouTube Battles on his Twitter account. YouTube Battles subscriber account absolutely went skyrocketed. It was gaining hundreds of subscribers every second. It was an absolute absolutely a crazy day. However, YouTube refuses to give YouTube bottles a silver play button. Why you may ask? I do not have the exact reason but I have a few theories. Remember the shadow ban incident? Well, it was probably because just YouTube just doesn't like his channel. It was also probably because he kept posting live subscriber count when YouTube have said that they don't want any of these. <laughs> But hey, that's just a theory. That's that theory. I'm sorry. But eventually, after some negotiations, YouTube have finally gave YouTube balls a super play button. Moving forward on July 29, 2022, Mr. Beast just hit over 100 million subscribers. And YouTube Bars was able to gain 10,000 subscribers this week by just live streaming Mr. Beast subscriber count. Even better when he published the Mr. Beast hitting 100 million subscribers video. And that video was actually one of his best performing video on his channel. On the same day, YouTube Bars was able to gain over 7,000 subscribers. After this, Today, YouTube Battles has 259,000 subscribers and averaging about 115,000 views and will probably grow more in the future. If you like this type of content, please subscribe. We're trying to hit 400 subscribers. We're stuck at 300 subscribers since like last year. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If you like this type of content, there's more of these type of stats documentaries like how FSCW became the most disliked thing and uh, the stats community iceberg, which literally took me a month to make. Yeah, thanks so much for the support and uh, yeah.